back with some more videos. I want y'all hit that like button, hit that sub button. We finna get right into it. Alright, coming up next, the main event, a matchup for the UFC lightweight division title. All right, here he is, the number one lightweight contender making his way to the octagon and looking to leave as the new undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. He has bided his time, waiting for this title shot. He's got the winning streak. He has the quality of opposition. Now he's fighting the number one guy in the world. He believes he's the best. Now his opportunity to prove it just a few minutes away. Well, in a division as talented as 155 pounds, it is absolutely remarkable what this man has accomplished. Here he is, folks, the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. Now, his goals, far more lofty than that. The title defenses are starting to pile up, but he believes with this type of challenger that has some momentum with fight fans, if he can dust this guy here tonight, he can take his career to the next level and start to be mentioned with the GOATs, the Hall of Fame. Man, y'all know what's going on. Now, I have more title defenses after UFC Khabib after champion. this. Stop it. We'll see how it goes for him tonight in Vegas. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. I ain't so even watched too much crazy film. These two fighters when I'm it not worried. To the age, with some differences in height and a similar reach. All right, now for the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. No matter what. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Eve Leving. Now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada, it's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC lightweight Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 22 wins, six losses. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Presenting the challenger, Armin Ahakalakis Zarukia. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 19 wins, one loss. He stands five feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Milwaukee, Wisconsin, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. Ooh, if I can't wait to fight him. He's looking, he's looking at me crazy. Ooh, all right, bet. You don't respect me. You don't shake my hand when it start either. You ready? I'm going to make you respect me, boy. You ready? All right, so here he is, the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC champion out of the red corner. Right, the Many cage, of you remember his title cage. defense not all Hands that long up. ago. He won it by Stay knockout. Strong. And most it. of the guys, the number one contender types who have risen to a title shot, 
have succumbed to his power. They think they know what it feels like, and then all of a sudden they get in the octagon, and they just can't take the pop. So we'll see how he handles this particular challenge here tonight. Certainly an outstanding grappler who could pose some different challenges if we hit the canvas. He told us his game plan is to... Oh, good entry there to take the fight to the grappling realm. Now we'll see what he can do from here, champ. This is exactly where he wants to be. Look for him to try to use ground and pound to open up submission opportunities. Let's go, you Big can do punch it. lands over Keep the top. How's he gonna follow this one? And he landed the right hand there. Zip that jab. All right, he'll engage in a single jab. collar tie. Oh, nice knees to the body. Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking okay, realm early in this okay. one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. Shot a double leg. Oh, ow. Slams him to the canvas with authority. Oh, trying to pass here, but Dikembe Mutombo style, he gets denied. Blocked! Great job blocking that pass by the bottom fighter. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent start to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. You're okay. Oh, that was a really nice takedown. Just over two minutes to go. Come on, push through it. Big powerful Stay punch strong. lands. Now he gets he back to range. Break your will. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Misses again with a right punch. Got clipped with a right hand. Able to check that kick as well. Big body kick. Oh, knee strike right to the midsection Keep there. Keep moving. Push oh, nice pace. right hand. Push the pace. You're in better shape than he is. You can make it work. That's a big Ooh. strike right there. Ooh. Oh, collar tie. They continue to exchange. He's doing a really good job of getting on that high crotch and just following the action. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Trying to pass the guard here, but a nice job by the bottom fighter defensively. Bottom fighter did a fantastic job of following with his hips. I, I'll give him that round. Block any attempt to get past just because of that. All right, now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? It was close, though. high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level the hard, though. match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills. Yeah, uh, maybe I won that round. I don't know. Okay, okay, sit down. Great. Good patience out there, man. You did great. Your striking looks amazing. Keep your hands up and stay sharp. You're out working this guy everywhere. Let's get to that head. All right, okay. round two is Don't now. Don't tell me that now. Ready? Don't, don't send me off now, ready? coach. It's exactly what we expected. We expected when we saw this on okay, the match let's go. that these you're two fight. guys were you evenly matched. Fight, let's see you who really pace. takes control. As he is damn near good. Round. I ain't gonna lie. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little Man, bit. Man, he has a great double leg. My Push goodness, he has a great double leg. Push him off. All right, trying to pass here, as Glover Teixeira might say, not today. Not today. Great job like of following with the hips, keeping those legs locked and keeping them oh. 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 land right there, the seminal blow of the fight. I mean, it was perfect. It was absolutely perfect, John. Great placement on that okay, uppercut. Okay, control now. Oh, nice job to reverse position on the ground. It was bad, but now it's not so bad. What a fantastic sweep. Flush right hand is true. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. I want you to get control of that clinch. Single collar tie now. Oh, and he gets tagged. Beautiful combination. A 
shenanigans. Not sure how many more of those can take. The night is almost over. If you keep getting hit with punches like this, you are going to sleep. Stuffs the takedown oh, there. How good is his takedown? I'm not playing with you, boy. The punch that lands down the middle, the one that you don't feel, is the one that land perfect, and that one landed stand perfect. Stand tight, stand tight. Keep the double leg. Double leg there. Double leg. Oh, big left. Nice hit. Oh, nice. straight right. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact go right single, moment. Go he deserves this moment. Take go we finish need, his fight. You need to take Big knee to the body. One minute, one minute left. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Beautiful good, strike. Good. Keep that pressure. Give me a one, two, three now. Body attack, and it's blocked. Back to the well with another takedown attempt here. It's good. I let him survive. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Back to the stand-up now. Both fighters upright. Keep it busy here on the clinch. Right, that's the end of round number two. Yeah, stop playing, me, boy. All right, all right, all right. Stop yes, playing. Yes, sit down. I'm on some demon time. Right. Hey, get him some water. Okay, slow that heart rate down. Deep breaths. All right, so a huge round for him there. That head kick probably would have had me out for good. The guy survives to see another round. Yeah, but he'll go back to that. It landed so perfectly. He set it up great. He did a great job of mixing up the target early, going up high, and getting the desired result. All right, next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty Ready? good back and forth action Ready? in the previous frame. Fight. Yes, it wasn't a firefight. It Work wasn't two guys man. going to Work kick the sink at each other. But you did see Stay time tight. when Work it came game, together man. and you saw the skill level. Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's move. move. Checks that leg kick. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Hands up. Nice loop and punch. And they separate. Distance. Hey, distance. Wow. Actually got the takedown. Time to work. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Stay strong. Get Stay up. strong. Keep moving. Went for the inside leg kick. Oh. There. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. All right, single collar tie now. Oh! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Back to the feet. Fighter trying to pass here, Ooh, but gets denied. Gets denied. Great job. Great recognition of seeing what your opponent Stay was trying tight. to do. Stay in tight. Grab the head. Back Grab to the, the feet head. now. Strong defense here as the hook to the You're head right. is blocked. Right. Oh, and he caught the kick. Let's get some offense. Let's get oh. Holy smokes. He put him to sleep. Protect your face. in the single collar tie. Take down, cut him. Take down, cut him. Over and over it's to okay. secure these takes. Use your defense. Okay. Use your Let defense now. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Double leg takedown attempt Don't here, go. and that one is it's true. Okay. Nice job there to Ooh, enter and ultimately footwork. plant his opponent on the mat. Now what does he do? That he's gotten his Protect best shot face. off, Hands finished up. the attack. Yeah, make sure I hit that like coming to that sub button, man. I told that boy, stop playing with me. Go your ass to bed.
All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 53 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, Butcher. All right, so there he is, the still UFC lightweight champion of the world. A lot of steam here during fight week that maybe there were a few things that could plague him tonight. Looked as good as ever for my money. He looked as good as he's ever looked inside the octagon. He's so good at everything, every single skill that you need to become champ. He has mastered, and he showed it in this fight. I'm gonna try to get a fight with Dustin Poirier, man. He be like, he don't want to fight nobody. I'm chasing greatness. Let's go ahead and move up. I might go back down to my weight class to be not there, so I don't know. Let's steal some more money. Let me see. Who am I fighting? I really don't want to fight nobody else in the lightweight division. Huh? I just want to fight Dustin Poirier, but he finna retire, man. Who champion? Come on, who champion? Oh, he too old. This is a gimme fight. I might go back to my weight class, man. I might move up. Me and my team got to see what's going on. Speed, timing, reaction. That's the goal today. Huge! Man, your next opponent is going to be no match for you. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, nice kick. Yeah, he felt that one. Uh-huh. Let's go. 30 on the clock. Beautiful combo. Keep at it. Hey, great job in there. Beautiful kicks with high volume. Nobody can stand up.
All right, you ready? I want to see good technique and form this round. Nice strike. That'll keep him honest. I love it. There we go! Thirty to go! Show me! Man, your next opponent is gonna be no match for you. Good, good, yes. Good work with your kicks. That's what I'm talking about. He's starting to fall apart. Stay busy. Stay busy. Your kicks are on point. Anytime you want to throw it, let it... Top position. That's where we want to be. So let's hit the mats and work till we get there. Good, good. Now, moving on to the next one. Great combo, keep it up. Good. Good. He can't get you down. Let's go. Beautiful job. You got 30. Let's go. Beautiful combination. Keep it up. Put the pressure on him. Don't worry about it. Let's move forward. I moved up trying to hurt some. I ain't gonna lie. All my sparring partners ain't getting spared. Let me see, Larry. Okay, Justin Gaethje, I can fight him again. Listen, Barboza, Connor, I'm, Look, we beat Joe Lozon, Michael Chandler, Mike DeKeese, Joe Lozon again, Matisse, I fight Rafael Fazi twice, Alexander Hernandez, Alec Quinto. I got knocked out, I ain't gonna lie. I got knocked out. Then I came back, I knocked Paul Felder out. 
Knock this line out. Knock Tony Ferguson out. Got my win back. I fired some Bob Rosa for the title. Fuck a beep. Fuck Con. I fired Justin Gaethje. And I just fought Armand. I didn't fight deep. I did good in the lightweight division. I, feel like I, I think I might move up. If I win. Just power on the bag now. Listen to my call outs. You're listening perfectly. Nice work. Man, your next opponent is going to be no match for you. Come on, 30 seconds left. Hey, good job today. You really crushed it out there. Nice, nice. All right, gonna hit some leather today. I'll call it out, you throw. Man, your next opponent is going to be no match for you. Great job in there. Your timing is really on point. Come on, 30 seconds left. Nice, nice. Really great job today. Nice form. Good technique on the...
Just power on the bag now. Listen to my callouts. Great job in there. Your timing is really on point. Man, your next opponent is gonna be no match for you. Don't stop now, 30 on the clock. Man, your next opponent is gonna be no match for you. Nice form, good technique on the- His cardio go crazy. some leather today. I'll call it out, you throw. Yes, I like what I saw today. That was some beautiful work. Hey, good job today. You really crushed it out there. Man, your next opponent is going to be no match for you. And 30 to go. I'm being in the best shape of my career. Nice form. Good technique on the... Who could have pictured this, huh? I mean, I always knew you were something special, but but this, this is next level. Only a handful of fighters have become double champs in the UFC. Some very rare company. And Ty, good. All right, at the end of the night, though, remember, it's just a fight. Stay focused on the task at hand. We can worry about finding more trophy space in the morning. <laughs> All right, let's go. Good. That's it. Well, what a moment we have got in front of us tonight. And for this fighter, one win away from UFC immortality. He became a UFC champion in one division. And tonight, he will try to become a simultaneous two-division UFC champion. Absolutely incredible. What 
can be accomplished in front of our eyes tonight. He is the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC welterweight champion in a division full of killers. He has remained the hunted at 170 pounds. Now, unquestionably staring at his toughest challenger to date, can he go back home as the champion? If he can, another chapter to one of the greatest welterweight legacies the Octagon has ever seen. All right, now let's get you our tail of the tape for this welterweight championship fight. Thompson is 19 years the elder. He is two inches taller. He will have a three-inch reach advantage. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Levin. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Walterweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 20 wins, one loss. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Introducing the challenger, Butcher. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a karate fighter, holding a professional record of 20 wins, 8 losses, and 1 draw. He stands 6 feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Simpsonville, South Carolina. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending UFC Walter White Champion of the World, Stephen Wonderboy Thompson. UFC belt on the line. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. I gotta beat him, y'all. Put overhands on him. Are you ready? All right, let's see if he can get off to a good start here tonight as he tries to become a simultaneous two-division UFC champion. This is some rare I just became a double champion in 13 seconds. Oh my goodness. Yes, sir. It goes into the books as a first round. I mean, we is 45. Perfect execution. The technique like was absolutely good. But I still. Again, when you catch a guy early, maybe you're getting him cold before he's had a chance to work up a sweat or even get into the fight a little bit. Those strikes can have a bigger effect, and it certainly did here tonight. So he did it. Unbelievable. He wins the super fight and makes UFC history by joining a select few in becoming a two-division UFC champion. His future is in the Hall of Fame. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at 13 seconds of the very first round. Declare by knockout and new undisputed UFC. Walter White, champion of the world, 
Butcher! Well, get that man a second waist, put a belt over his shoulder. He has become a two-division UFC champion here tonight. Rarified air. Only a select handful of guys in the history of the Ultimate Fighting Championship have won a belt in two divisions, and you can add his name to that list. Absolutely incredible what he accomplished in this arena here tonight. Make sure you hit that like, comment, and that sub button. We're gonna be back with some more videos. I wanted to challenge for my first fight. I thought it uh, was a way, but uh, next fight we're gonna be getting it in. Make sure you stay tuned. We'll be back with some more videos. You dig?